Good morning. It's 6.15. It is show day. I am making a um, cup of coffee and um, I'm going to eat some breakfast. And it's raining here in Texas again for the 5011th day. Um, so I actually think Michelle is going to come pick me up because I'm afraid my spray tan is going to melt. So, <sighs> morning abs. Um, I woke up at 105 today, which is what I wanted. So I'm kind of kind of can't believe that came together um yeah so I'll try my best to document this for everybody um I'm just gonna drink some coffee watch the news see when the weather's gonna clear up and then um head out for uh to get hair and makeup done yeah, so. around Benton to Plano Frisco McKinney seeing the heavy rainfall come down frequent cloud ground lightning strikes as well same thing around DFW Airport we're experiencing that here and okay so pre-judging is over and I got second call outs for open and first call outs for masters and I have like my Sherpa team here Justina and Haiti and Kim and Michelle I totally meant to do a vlog but I got really excited and I'm kind of hungry so um brain's not really functioning um, so yeah, stay tuned. We're going to back to my house. I think we're gonna eat some stuff and maybe drink a glass of wine. We'll okay guys, so it is 4.30. Um, we have to be back up at finals at 5.30. Um, I'm looking pretty lean still. Um, I've actually eaten kind of like a ton. I think I've had about like seven uh, tablespoons of peanut butter and um, I haven't had a ton of carbs. I'm going to eat carbs before I get on stage. I have some caramel rice cakes and this cookie, but I'm kind of over the cookie. See, I knew that this was going to happen. All the stuff that sounded good yesterday doesn't sound good. What sounds really good right now is like a super big cheeseburger. So I think that's what I'm going to eat post-show or maybe some sushi. I haven't decided. Um, with a ton of like sodium or soy salt and my skin's going to go blah. Like anyways. Um, okay. So I got home and... Um, Michelle and Haiti and Kim came over and they hang out and we had a glass of champagne. Anyways, um, after they left, um, Adam came home with the girls and I read a story to Marin. She loves the Elmo story, so I read that. Um, made them a snack, spilled up orange juice, changed a poopy diaper. Um... <laughs> Yeah, all the mom stuff, so the not so glamorous. It was really funny though because the mailman came and I had a package that I was expecting. So I kind of opened the door because I normally go out to get the package as soon as they drop it off because we've kind of, we live on a corner and we think that our packages were stolen one day. So anytime that they drop it off, I try to go out there as soon as I can. Anyway, so he was like, oh, it's like, he was out there and I said, oh, thanks. And he turned around and was like, and then I was like, oh yeah, I'm all oranged up. So I'm sure he kind of thinks that I looked crazy. <laughs> so um, let's see, what else? I'm getting stuff ready for finals. Um, I don't know what else is going on. I haven't really had too much water to drink, um, but I've had enough, been sipping on this. I'm super happy with my makeup. Um, I love it. Erin Blair Gobin did it. Um, I wish I knew what her company was called, but she's done my engagement photos, my boudoir photos, my wedding photos, my pretty much any time that I needed hair and makeup, I've asked her. She's never done um, fitness competitions, so I asked her, and I said, hey, I've got this competition. Do you think she could do it? She said, oh, I think I'm totally up for the challenge. And I was like, okay. Um, and seriously like I've received so many compliments on my makeup backstage so um, totally worth the money if anyone's looking to do a competition I highly recommend getting your hair and makeup done um, so anyways still looking pretty lean let's see I got a picture taken there's a gun show going on outside so I got my picture taken by got your tickets to the gun show funny right okay anyways I will see you guys at finals <laughs> Oh 
49. Okay, so I'm the worst vlogger ever. Um, we are at Sushi Axiom. There's a waiter. Hi. Um, so yeah, I have an update. First place. Ah, so excited. So we are here with everybody. Hi. Perna, Haiti, Shane. Hello, Michelle. Say hi, Jimmy. Everybody, Chris, Shad, and Paula. Okay, so we're all here. We're eating. Um, so though it was super fun. Um, I can't believe I placed. I was actually legitimately surprised that I got the first call out um, in Masters. So the fact that I got like first place, I was just, I think I looked silly. And there was a point at when like when they raise all your hands up that I've always dreamed like that's going to be me. I'm going to be up there. Ah! So they did it and the girl next to me was like 5'10". So I almost like fell off and I was like, oh, I'm not that tall. So anyways, it was super fun. So yeah, we're here. I've had a glass of wine, and so I feel amazing. Um, anyways, yeah, Chris, say hi. I'm gonna show a picture of him because he's super pale, and we got a good app. No, I have very healthy skin. Is what that means. My this skin is fake is very tan. Healthy. This is not a real tan. <laughs> this is a fake it means tan. I have healthy skin. Say hi. Did you say 20 weeks. I did it for 20 weeks. You're on my you're on my vlog. I have a YouTube channel. I might even share it with you. Okay. So, anyways, yay! Okay. So, I we are at um, where are we at? We're at Red Velvet Taco. Velvet Taco, and I just had this amazing cake with like caramel sauce. It was amazing. I took a photo with where are they? Those police officers back there, and everybody's here. So, it's Perna and Katie, say hi. Kristen, say hi. She's here and she's hiccup free. She's hiccup free since 1993. Hello, yay. You're welcome. He's over us. Um, Abe, yay, 